Okay, guys, real quick. Um, I just got done filming my third day here with this. I think I told you, I think I left off in the last vlog that um, that was second day hair and I thought that it would last till day three. Well, this is day three. And again, I will sh let you know. Um, actually, this is a wash and go using Alake Naturals Creme Brulee. So I'll let you know that at least. Um, hopefully that video is already out. If it is, I'll link it. If not, it'll it's going to be coming up shortly. So keep a lookout for it if you want to see how I actually got um, these results. So yeah, I wanted to come on too to show you my eyes. I don't know if they look good or not. <laughs> but I also um, opened up the Juvia's Place palettes that I got and this is the bronze rustic this is what I use today for the look on my eyes and um, I think it's pretty I think it's a nice fall look so I basically used the gold color I use this um, they don't have the colors like listed on here but I use the gold one and I use this one um, in the corner and then I use this one kind of as a transition or whatever. I don't know if that's good or not. But anyway, that is what I did. And then I just um, put a little bit of that on my brow line, which I don't normally do too often, but I just did it. I probably shouldn't. But anyway, that's what I did. I just wanted to see what all of them kind of looked on. The only one I didn't use, or the only ones that I didn't use were these two right here. So I will... Um, break into those two. I'll break into those um, shortly because I wanna see what they look like too since it's becoming fall. Anyway, um, I actually wasn't gonna get on today, but um, my husband wants to go out. We were gonna go out for lunch and do some errands and everything like that, but he's already eaten lunch, so I'm getting ready to go have lunch here and then after he gets done with a little bit more work, we're gonna go out because we want to look at some dishwashers which I told you guys about and um, well you know we'll probably be out long enough so we'll end up picking up dinner out so hopefully you know I'll get some footage of that I'll try to take take the camera with me for that um, stuff but yeah I I did want to ask you guys um, what are, what else do you guys want to see on my channel what else do you guys want to see on my channel? So, uh, I think I said earlier in the vlog that I was going to be trying to brainstorm for next year and stuff like that. So, um, just reiterating, because I don't know if this is a whole new vlog or if it's a continuation of the old vlog, but in either case, I wanted to mention it again. If you have ideas for my channel, please list, list them below just to help a girl out. And I also said earlier that I had ordered um, the green apple and aloe gel and the clear one came. This is this is the white one that I pretty much used up. There's hardly nothing in it, not even enough for a whole nother wash and go, but I'm trying to hold on to it because I was hoping that I would get another white one and I can add this to it. Well, that one was clear. I told you I was gonna con uh, see, contact Amazon, see what I need to do because I ordered it off Amazon and they basically told me to keep it. They refunded me my money and everything, but they told me to just go ahead and keep it. So now I have that. Um, and uh, so I wanted to let y'all know that. So if, if it shows up and y'all see it, I don't want y'all saying, you bought a product? No, they said I could keep, well, I did buy it, but um, you know, I was planning on sending it back, but they said that I could keep it. And um, I have not heard back from Talia Wajid. So I did actually email them to inquire about the jail and I haven't heard back. So I'm waiting to hear from that. So I wanted to kind of just fill y'all in on that as well. So. Guys, this room is a mess. It's a mess, it's a mess, it's a mess, and I need to clean it up. The other thing I wanna do too is I wanna move some stuff around. So this pattern stuff, I want to move it somewhere else since I've pretty much tried most of it. I was leaving it back there for one because it looks nice. It's a nice color, kind of a pop of color, but also to remind me that I wanted to review the products and to use the products. So that's why I have them there. Now that I've used most of them, I want to move it and put something else over there. And then the 
Eden Lavender. I did try it when I first got it and um, I did something wrong. It was a user error, so I didn't want to come on and talk about it when I knew that I had done something wrong. And I can't even remember because it's been so long ago and I've been meaning to get back to it. And I've just been putting it off doing other things. Um, you know, kind of getting to other products. So I want to go back and revisit that. So it is on my um, to do. So, but I still want to move it to and put something else there. So I want stuff there. So when I'm looking in the camera, I can see and it reminds me, okay, I need to use that next. I need to use that next. I need to use that next. So, you know, hopefully I'll be changing this around pretty soon. Um, and I usually have y'all zoomed in more so y'all can't see the bottom, but y'all see, y'all can kind of see down there. Don't look at my, I got, you know, don't look in that mirror over there. Don't look, don't look in that mirror. Don't look in that mirror. <laughs> But anyway, so I got products all down there and everything too. Yeah, let me out in. Y'all be trying to, y'all be trying to, y'all be trying to see too much. And then y'all be like, oh, I peeped such and such in there. When you gonna use that? I peeped. <laughs> gotta keep y'all, gotta keep y'all in suspense. Um, but anyway, so yeah, I want to um, get a little, I, want, I need to go eat and I need to get a few other things done before we leave. So I'm going to kind of, you know, let you guys go for now. Like I said, I'll try to take you along with us when we go out. So I'll talk to y'all in a bit. Okay guys, another thing real quick. Um, when I was looking to change stuff around, as you can see, I added my boucle, clam, boucle, clam. I think somebody said it's called boucle. clam. Anyway, when I put that up here, I found my bread, not found, I mean it was down there, I knew it was down there, but I've been pushing it to the back, pushing it to the back, pushing it to the back because I just don't have a desire to use these products. I shouldn't even have got, gotten them, but they were on sale. I got them when they were like 30% off or something like that. But this is the Briogeo Curl Charisma Rice Amino and Avocado Leave-In Defining Cream, never been used and the Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. So I know a lot of people had talked about um, really liking this deep conditioner. So when, I can't remember if I got these from Ulta or Briogeo site or whatever. Anyway, some, or is it support us? I don't know. Anyway, I got them on sale when they were 30% off. Um, and this still has the seal on it. I've never used them and I, I don't want to. I just don't have the desire. And then when I looked at this, don't uh, despair repair, it has four proteins in it off the bat that I saw, you know, at a glance. So there's no telling however many more that's in there. And I just feel like I prefer more moisturizing. Um, and I'm not saying that this is not moisturizing. I haven't tried it, so I don't know. But I know that I prefer um, mask that don't have so many proteins in them. Um, I just don't feel like I need that much protein. I do like uh, deep conditioners and masks that have some protein with mixed with a whole lot of moisturizing ingredients. So I still get what I need. Um, but this one just having four, I'm just like, mm, I don't know if I'm gonna get the feel that I like. And I don't wanna do a review and say, well, I like, you know, for me, it's good, but for me, you know, it's not something I've got, you know. Now, let me just give this, my give. Um, let me just get rid of these so somebody who really loves them or wants to try them can. So what I am going to do is I'm gonna put these on my Macari and I'm gonna sell them. They're brand new. If you're interested, you need to go over to my Macari and see if they're still there. They're probably gonna go very quickly. Another thing too, guys, is I don't always get on here and say, hey, I'm gonna put this on Macari, I'm gonna put this on Macari. I don't always have time. Sometimes I just have time to say, you know what, I want this snap a picture and upload it real quick. So it's in your best interest if you think that there's anything that I may be getting rid of or that you wanna try, it's in your best interest to just click, you know, I have a link in my description box of my Macari page, as well as a link to sign up for Macari. So if you, uh, it's probably in your best interest to just click that link periodically 
and see if anything new has been put out there, anything that you might be interested in. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these because I just, I'm like, I don't really, you know, I'm not really interested. Um, I'm not that invested in Briogeo. I did try their one deep conditioner that's in the green like tub or jar and it was good. I really did like that one. I'll link it here. I can't remember the name of it offhand. It's avocado something. Um, but I also tried some of their shampoo and conditioner and I didn't care for that. So I just know these could be hit or miss for me. And for the price, I don't want to open them up, not like them. And then now they're used and I probably won't get, get back to them. So I'd rather just go ahead and get rid of them while they're brand new and somebody else can use them. So check my Macari. Link is in the description box if you're interested in these Briogeo products. The other thing too is Briogeo, I believe, has been acquired and I don't think they're not any longer black owned. Don't mark my words, but I don't think they're any longer black owned. And um, for the price of these products, I don't want to pay for them, especially if they're not black owned. I want to support black owned brands if I can, not meaning that I will never use other brands because I will, I have, <laughs> I have other brands here. But if I am, um, hopefully they're going to be more reasonable than however much this was, like $38 for a jar of deep conditioner, something, something outrageous for eight ounces. It was something outrageous. So yeah, just wanted to pop on real quick and say that while I was cleaning this out. And so with that being said, I'm probably going to find some other stuff that I want to put on there as well. So again, this may not be the only thing out there. So you want to just periodically go out there and look and see if anything new has popped up. All right. That's all I wanted to say. Ooh. So we um, are out getting something to eat. Sorry, guys, I didn't get on earlier, but AJ Avery just went in to see um, how long the wait is because it's packed out here. We want to go to AJ's again. That's the same place I went with my cousin Taki, if y'all saw that vlog. We like it, but I kind of wanted something else. But the owner of that place owns the Italian place next door, and he said it's the best Italian in town. So I told him to try that place. So maybe we'll end up at the Italian place. Don't really have um, a taste for Italian, but it's different from AJ's. So we'll see. Okay, Avery's calling. Hold on. Home. Dark in here, I can't see. Oh, 